Hello everyone. Good morning. Welcome to my channel that is Udu for Beginners. Today we are going to just continue with our last session that is regarding with analytic accounts and analytic plan. In the last session it was regarding with that retail clothing shop that selling those t-shirts with the men, women or kids category. Okay. But if you have remember, just let me open one of the sets order for that. Okay, so we are just selecting my customer and we are just selecting any my products. Okay, it's kids t-shirts and then from the category itself we are selecting the kids. Here we can see that this is the menu elections. Each and every transaction you have to apply those analytic accounts manually. So it increases, it, it, it wastes our time. What happens if we can do some kind of the automation? Yes, we can do it and here that feature using that feature we can do the automation is the analytic distribution model analytic distribution model is one feature that automatically assign the analytic accounts as well as the distribution percentage to single transactions okay so without wasting the time let's understand with one use case okay so here we have accounting in the accounting itself in the configuration we are going with that analytic distribution model now what is this exactly i am creating a new here you can see that this is the analytic distribution model here you can see that the conditions to meet with the partner partner category accounts to prefix product product category and company we are dealing with one simple example with that product category okay we have one category which is my kids we want if the product belongs to category of the product category, the analytic distribution model will be selected with the kids. This is the first with the 100%. I am just going to create one more with product category of women. Okay. With analytic distribution model regarding with that women. Okay. Now one more we can set for any product category you can. Now what we are going to do, we are going to do the one more transaction with this category so it will be clear. I am going to create the invoice. In the invoice itself I am just creating the customer and here my product is kids t-shirt. Currently you can see that analytic account is not selected it's a blank okay now as i'm selecting kids t-shirt you can see the kids is automatically there so here there will be no chance to selecting the wrong analytic account and it saves our time also the same can we can apply for all our other products and product category here you can do it for the product category and if you want to do it for particular product itself you can do it so just let me go to for that analytic account distribution models again this is my analytic distribution models okay now here you can see that i'm going to create a new and view here we can, you can select any particular product and you can apply the analytic this it will be same work as a product category now here you can see that partner and partner category also what is this partner and partner category partner means you can use that restored partner if you want that want to link those partners with the analytic account you can just you have to select the partner just I am considering my favorite which is the jazz and here you can apply the analytic distribution model to with that partner so if your sales order purchase those invoice bills or any transactions particular with that partner then your analytic accounts will be selected automatically this is same for my partner category what is the partner category partner category simple meaning is the tagging here in the customer itself we are tagging them with retailer wholesaler okay and if we want to find that what will be the amount between those retail and wholesaler then what we can do just let me go to the customers in the customer itself i am selecting one of the customers here we can apply the tags also i am not sure something happens with this database here we can apply the tags and after applying the tags we can configure the analytic distribution model based on the tags so let me show you how here you can apply uh, i am not sure why this is problem with the partner category here we can select those tags and if let's consider we have one tag for the retailer and we can apply that analytic distribution based on that so if your customer belongs to retailer or wholesaler will be there then belong to that analytic distribution analytic account will be fetched automatically okay and this is most important is accounts prefix that i will explain later with one use case so this is simple that if 
you want to make the automation you can do it you can configure for product product category and partner category of the partner and the account prefix also now let me go with one more advanced use case here it is not necessary just you can apply the one account for one transaction you can apply the multiple analytic accounts with your distribution percentage okay let me give you one example one use case that here we are selling those product categories kids men and women but here we are again running one market campaign through third party that promoting our kids women and men t-shirt selling promotions okay now here we are getting the bill for register those marketing expense and what we want because this expense is not belong to only kids not belong to only women or not belong to only men it is the accumulation of this three category because this marketing campaign for three all category how we can do that because if we are I'm getting getting the bill for that thousand dollar i don't want that thousand will be booked for those those kids only i want that it will be divided with kids men and women it's very simple okay so how we can do that here we are going to use the concept of account prefix so if i am going to the chart of account i have created one chart of account with the marketing expense if i am going with that here you can see that for the marketing expense my code is 211601 now i am going to use the same code in our distribution model okay so let me go to an analytic distribution model again i am going to click a new now let me click on view here what we want to do here we want when your vendor bill vendor bill with the account of 211601 211601 okay then your analytic distribution account will be distributed with the category of kids with the 30 percentage again with adeline with man with the 70 percent i want to make it the 30 percentage and with women with 40 percentage okay here you can see that if your vendor will will be booked with particular this account then it will be divided into these three so it is not necessary it will be with one analytic account it will be for multiple analytic account this is your just let me save it here i have put the whole chart of account if you can use the prefix also if you will use the prefix of 211 then what udu will consider udu will consider all the chart of accounts that start from 211 but i want to be more specific that i have used this chart of accounts course okay now let's go to the our uh, accounting and creating one bill okay i'm just going to create a one bill i'm selecting any vendors and i am just selecting any products over here okay now here you can see that no any analytic accounts are there now what i am going to do i am going to do specific with those marketing expense so i have created one products also for marketing expense my is marketing okay yeah marketing campaign is that this is my product now i am going to create the bills for that so in going to bills new i am selecting that window let's consider window 1 now my product is marketing now i am selecting this account currently manually currently no any analytic accounts are as i will select those here you can see that it comes automatically so there is no need to put it manually and there is no need to keep in mind that how much percentage will be on kids how much percentage will be on man and how much percentage on will be the women so this is one simple use case to explain the concept of analytic distribution model using this feature you can make more automation to save your time do it from your sides and let me know if you are stuck somewhere we are here to help you thank you everyone